Hi, this is a quick uh, video I thought I'll make about rates and rate chases. It's not always about the rate, and that's really important. I get so many clients come to me where they've been getting quotes from, I don't know, comparison sites or other brokers, and they say to me, well, hang on a minute, I've been quoted a 1.49, and you've quoted me a 1.69. Why have you quoted me a more expensive product? Well, uh, let's put aside all the criteria and all the bits and pieces that there could be, you know, there could be an issue around. The simplest terms is, I like to quote based on the term. So whether it's a two year fixed or a five year fixed or whatever the fixed period is, um, I like to look at what the rate is, as well as what the fees are, as well as what incentives there are. I'll give you an example. You can have a product with a 1.49 rate. Let's just assume it's a buy to let deal. Okay, it's a remortgage, 1.49. Fantastic, looks really good. That's the highest off on the table. However, once you start putting in, there could be another product with a lender that could have a lower fee, lending fee. So instead of having a 2,000 pounds fee, it's got a 999 fee. Plus, because it's a remortgage product, it's got free valuations, maybe free legals within that as well. Plus, some lenders will give you a cash back of up to, I don't know, 250, 500 pounds. All of a sudden, depending on what the loan size is, it may not, the, 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 the product with the lower rate may not be the best products. Over the first two years or five year period, it might actually be more expensive because by the time you put the cash back in there, the free valuations, the free legals, any other incentives in there, that's probably not the best product. So rate is not always about rate, it's about putting the whole deal together, the whole product, and whether it's, it's more cost effective for the clients. So please try to look beyond rates always, look at the products, look at the incentives, look at the benefits uh, of, of that specific product, let alone the service, you know, the, the various service uh, comparisons you can make, and as well as, you know, the, obviously the most important is criteria. Some of the best products out there um, have got very low loan to value limits, so 50%, 60% loan to value, so that may not be you. If it's borderline on the loan to values, um, you know, what happens if there's a down valuation? What's the next product? Um, what's the criteria like? What's the rental calculation if it's buy to let? If it's residential, obviously, what are the income multiples? What are other sort of how do they treat your income? So look beyond rates. That's the most important thing. Rate is very important. You've got to get a good rate, but also it's looking at the overall picture when it comes to product selection. Thank you very much. I hope you found the video useful. One more important thing I have to mention with all of these videos and everything that we've got on our website and, and on the YouTube channels is getting a mortgage is a serious thing, okay? If you fail uh, to keep up your repayments uh, on your mortgage, you could be in danger of getting repossessed. So it's really, really important that you think about a mortgage as a long-term thing, okay? It's not for one year, it's not for two years. You may have affordability now, you may not have it later on. So it's really, really important. You think about getting a mortgage, it's a very serious thing. You wanna make sure you keep the property that you're buying. If you do find yourself in difficulty, the first point of course should be to contact your existing lender, see what they can do for you, ask for help. There are professional advisors that could help you around this thing because it's really important you keep on top of things rather than sort of putting things away and, and, and putting them in the background because uh, uh, like I said, it's your livelihood and it's your roof over your head. So please, please try to keep up repayments with your mortgage. That should be all of our goals. Thank you.